Are we live again? Is this the, okay, this is live again? We're good? Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't know. For some reason, as soon as I came back from my break, everything just decided to crash on me. So that's fun. Uh, we're good now. Uh, thankfully, it didn't happen in the middle of the stream. It only happened for a second. Awesome. So let's get back to it. Let's go figure out what the hell the baker's doing. Because that was kind of a dick move, not going to lie. Um, I want my, I want little Timmy's soul back. It's been all that work, getting little Timmy out of the well. And we don't even get to keep the soul. It's bullshit. I thought we were going to have to go further this way. No, it's literally just right here. Oh, red cave. Okay. Uh, I feel like there's going to be something down here. It seems strange for there to be stairs here, but nothing to do with them. Uh, let's see. Do we wanna... Which looks like the main route to progress. Okay, the other one was the main route, so this is just kind of... Treasure. 20 SE. Cool. Some upgrades going. Got 154. That's a lot. Uh, might as well get the rest of our skills maxed out. Improve sleep, which we've never even used. Improve red flame. Uh, is this the other fl blue flame? Let's learn it. And let's learn purple flame. Soundtrack is so funky. I love it. Strong Lane. <laughs> Not the flex. I'm gonna put you to sleep because I can. I don't know if you actually went to sleep though. Doesn't matter anyway. What's this say? Notice, beware of beware of broken bridge. It's pretty easy to decipher. That's fine. Uh, oh, can we do anything there? No, 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 don't need to do it again. That's a door down there for sure. Can't put torches on the wall like that and not expect me to go through it. Wait, now it's Carol with an E? This is like the superpowered version because she has more letters in her name. So you flinch, and then, uh, oh, I should be used to purple flame. That's fine. So, part of me is wondering if, um, Part of the difficulty came from stream elements just told me I'm live. Pretty sure I was already live though, wasn't I? The stream elements just being weird and slow. Uh anyway, I, I thought we needed to fill these up before we could fill these up, and maybe that was the case, but maybe not. But these seem like the crucial ones that actually like progress, and that probably would have made things a lot easier in, in normal difficulty as well. Hopefully uh, none of the game got cut off right there. I don't know if stream elements is just being slow or what. Thing on you. Okay, so it's just being slow. That's good. Good to know. Door! That's a good bridge. It's not a broken bridge. Are we supposed to be aware of a broken bridge? Maybe this is the broken bridge. I don't know. Oh, it's Timmy. Hello! What's that spark on its head? 
Oh, that's not Timmy. Timmy's still in our pocket. What is this thing? No, no, doesn't matter. If you say so. Oh, little Timmy, you crack me up. Spark is gone. Wait, what color are you? You're purple. Alright. Oh, I guess it blew up while I was in the menu. Ah! Well, there's the broken bridge. How are we supposed to cross now? Relax, Lala. Relax. Your life is on the run. You know that. Oh, I'm sorry, Timmy. It's okay. But, um... What if I don't get it back? Can we at least spend our time together happily? That'd be nice. Seriously, I can't handle this edgy atmosphere. I'll get your soul back. And I'll chill out a bit. For you. Now let's go find another way around. That part kind of sounds like, like, there's a little bit of the song that sounds like the Flintstones. Meet the Flintstones, Happy Stone Age Family. But then it, like, really immediately turns into something else. But listen closely and you might hear a part of it that sounds kind of like the Flintstones. Or maybe that's just me, I don't know. Yes, e. What's that? What's that? I don't know what that is. I can't interact with it. Is this like a nail or something, I guess? Can't do much there. Uh, this wall looks like it might break now. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> well, that's not the way around, I guess. Back over here, and oh, there's a secret route down here. Just couldn't access it before. Hey, Timmy, I've been thinking we can come out for a bit, huh? I mean, you don't have to stay inside there all the time. Yes, hold on, Timmy, there's still rules. You're not allowed to come out when I'm fighting or when someone else is around, including ghosts. Got it? Mm-hmm. Got it. You can now talk with Timmy. Open up your pocket and select him to talk. Oh, that's cute. Oh, uh, let's do that. Talk it. Talk to Timmy. Sis, didn't you want me to stay in my pocket because you were afraid someone was going to snatch me or something? Yes. Well, what happened? I don't see a single reaper in here. Nobody's following us anymore. Who's going to see you? Ghosts! Oh, look at that. It's, I love that. It's adorable. And you're a ghost, too. They won't hurt you. Oh, yeah? How do you know that? It's like too busy trying to hurt me. Oh. Well, I can help too. Let me do something out in a reaping. Hey, why are you turning away from me? Hey, what? What is going on with the model? I don't know. The sprite looks weird to me for some reason. Maybe that's just the color.
Okay, but what, yeah. Okay, so for some reason, I'm not sure why, it's really weird, but when you're in this room, you're not allowed to look down. You're only allowed to look left and right. You can look up, but you can't look down. So I'm trying to go down right now, and I'm just facing left. That's a very odd animation error, and I don't entirely get why. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see, we got a whole bunch of points. Let's finish buying shit up here. Max out of frames. What is this? Poison? Sure. Max it out? Sure. This? No. Ace? No. We have to wait. Is that thing? Go to SE. Got it. Is um, should I just close, you know? Activity is not exactly active tonight anyway, so I think I'm just gonna like hide that instead of having a block part of the screen. Um Yeah. That's fine. Not much is going on there anyway. I'd rather just keep the screen uncovered. function, but it, it'd just be a really shitty thing to do and I would question, question you forever. I mean, Timmy. I mean, it's fine to eat people and all, because they're full of nutrients, and, and uh, it's, you know, okay, maybe the jury's out on whether you should eat people, but don't eat Timmy. Timmy's a ghost. There's nothing to value in Timmy. No delectable human brain. Just a spirit. feel fully rested. Ghost ran away. I couldn't get much. I'm sorry. Don't be Timmy. It's not your fault. I'm assuming you weren't supposed to die there, but they just have like different... I like that even if you're just dying, they change it up what happens after you die. It's 
kind of give a neat touch. Makes it feel slightly more intentional. So let's get more healed. That last fight sucked really bad. Um, off the fuck out of the defense. so many times. Muffin has a blueberry flavor. Restores. Oh, I like the muffin picture. I mean, it's a skull, but it's like, I like how they did it. The layout's nice. And then the baguette is a baguette from, from a trader. It's a baguette from a trader. Our last gift from who I thought was a friend. Maybe they're still a friend. Okay, straight up, this, this looks just like an area from Undertale. Uh, this is where the, this is where, like, the boat guy shows up and ferries you around. You can see a path below, but how am I supposed to get there? No way I can handle that many ghosts at once. Let's just wait a couple of minutes and then we'll be gone. We're moving out, see? And if they're not gone, we'll find a way. Besides, it'd be good for you to rest a minute. You'll look exhausted. Ah, do I? Sorry. Do you remember, Dad? Oh, it's, it's going to get sad again. Hmm? Dad, I've been thinking about him recently, ever since we came here. I remember we had a Dad. I remember we had a dad, but my memory's kind of foggy. He was nice, smiled a lot. You were too young. Don't say that like it's my fault. No, it isn't. Having you around made things a lot more bearable. I really loved dad. I loved... Love mom, too. But towards the end, they used to fight a lot about money. He got stressed really easily. He already had bad health conditions, but the arguments made it worse. And then eventually, it got fatal. Fatal? I was saying deathly. They'd already stopped fighting at that point, but he passed away anyway. We should have been together when he did, but Mom withdrew into herself. I think at the time, I sort of blamed her in a way for the fights and then withdrawing, even though I knew it was unfair of me to do so. After all, some of the fights were on Dad, too, right? I don't know. To be honest, I think the thing I hate the most about seeing parents argue is that you feel like you have to take a side. 
I'm glad that at least you don't have to experience that, Penny. Things got hard. For a while, Mom didn't do the chores. Then we needed money because our insurance. Oh, wait, I forgot you don't know what that is. Never mind. Anyways, Mom wasn't home a lot, so I learned to do a lot of things by myself. Groceries, dishes, laundry. I had to search a lot of it up. I was alone a lot. Or I would have been. You were home. You were young and confused, so you didn't really understand what was going on. You were unaffected. When I was done, finished my work, finished my chores, I played with you. You were the only normal thing. My mom finally managed to stay home a bit once things settled down. You made her smile a lot, but things were left unsaid between us. We weren't as close as what we used to be. Why did you tell me all of that? I don't know. I wanted to tell someone. I never got a chance to. Ah, the path's cleared. I think we can cross now. Let's hurry. Are you sure you'll be fine? What? Don't worry about me, Penny. Be much more worried about yourself. Let's get going. Can't go those ways, that's just for the ghosts. Oh. This is interesting. Do we have any more skill upgrades? Wait off. Wow. That one's weird. I like that though, I like the clock though. It's interesting that the music doesn't change for combat in this area, it just kind of keeps going the same. It's, it's been kind of neat how each cave has had like its own battle theme, which I think is a really nice touch. Did I stop time? I think I did. Um, because so many RPGs are just like, you got one battle theme and you gotta listen to it for the whole game. And this isn't even a very long RPG, but they change it up constantly. Very appreciated. I think I mentioned this. Like Pokemon is a great example because that game has like so many fantastic songs for like all of the different like cities you go to, and then like you'll have like the gym battles, and they'll have their own song. But then like 95% of combat throughout the entirety of the game, you're just listening to the same song, and it's just like I want a chance to hear all of the music. Equally. Jeff Fletcher Stone would have panned. Not the poison. Morbid muffins. I think it's about time for that. Oh, there's 200? Wow, that's a lot. End game food. Super good. I think this is end game. I don't know. Again, I think this game is only supposed to be a few hours long. I imagine we're kind of getting close to the end with this segment. Final confrontation with the baker. I suppose. This room's kind of a lot. Okay, 
Okay, the last clock we fought did nothing. This one's insane. Uh... I get it, I get it. You like taking double turns. You like taking triple turns. That's fine. Really? Four turns before I get to do anything? Okay. Okay, slow down there, fella. This is quite a lot. And I am not ready for it. You good? I already took us four turns before I even got to take any turns again. Figures. Okay. Said no. I think it's time for more mo- Oh, they like food drops on like every single enemy now though, so that's fine. We can do this. This is just getting ridiculous. Right? My meter hasn't even filled up a single time yet. What the hell? Okay. This is, this is insane. This is actually insane. Like, I'm not just standing around doing nothing. I just haven't even had my normal attack during that. This is crazy. Uh-huh. You good? You done doing that? Some food, make some upgrades. It's kind of. I want to max out the defense if that's even possible. It's bringing up spirit energy. Okay, I guess it's maxed out then. Um, up the specials more. Oh, speed. Because of those stupid clock things, I need all the speed I can get. Alright. Come at me. I dare ya. I'm ready for anything right now. There's no clock, so this is not gonna be as ridiculous. Or it will. <laughs> okay. You good? You good there, buddy? Faded away. This looks like the final route. I don't know if it, ah, fuck it. Go this one to see what happens. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's definitely the final route. That would be, that's the door we saw on the horizon. The cave we saw on the horizon. It's a dead end. Well, unless you cap that giant ominous hole in the wall. I don't think either of us want to pass on. 
This is the passing on place, right? Shouldn't he be here? Yeah, that's what the Reaper told us. You think I took a wrong turn somewhere? Did Grim get the message? Shh. Someone's coming. Get in my pocket. It's him, isn't it? The baker. That's not the baker. Who are you? Are you Baker? Oh, it might be the Baker. No, it's not the Baker. Not the Baker, everyone. Not the bright man. That's odd. Because you sound exactly like him. Guys, I think it's the Baker. It's definitely the Baker. I don't want any trouble. I don't want any trouble. Just put me through, please. Not until you tell me who you are. I'm a hardworking reaper. I spent years collecting spirit energy so I can pass on. The last time I checked, reapers don't glow. I don't know what you're talking about. Baker, I can literally see the soul glowing out of your eye holes. Like a certain Sans Undertale. Give it up. Give it up. If you... Look, if you don't take off your mask, and I'll take it off by force. No, no, no. Okay. Okay, the soul doesn't belong to me. But it doesn't belong to you either. Eh? The soul belonged to a ghost until you reaped him. You murdered that ghost. I don't see why you should get a second chance at life. Ah, uh, no. That's not why I want the soul. Huh? Timmy! Mr. Baker, that soul belongs to me. Please give it back. I think I've changed Timmy's voice like 20 times, but that's okay. You get the point. It's Timmy. Little Timmy. He's gone through puberty. His voice changes a lot. Ghost puberty. What in bread? A talking ghost? He's my brother. He lost his soul when he came here. I found him and tried to get his soul back so we can go home. But then you misunderstood and knocked me out. So it really does run in the family. What? Your cheek marks. <gasps> Timmy does have the cheek marks. So you believe me? You'll get it back? Of course I do. Hold on, I just need to take it out. Come on. It's stuck. Try harder. It's not working. I think you need to come over and help me. I don't trust you, Baker. Not at this point. Fine. Timmy, stay back. Just put your hand under there. Okay. You put your hand under the mask, but... Not surprised, this guy turned out to be a dick. I think I'd fall for that twice. It was worth a try. You really did a number on my mouse, huh? Guess I don't need it anymore. He discards it. I'm not giving up to this life, Lavender. I want to go home. So does he. I don't really care about your brother. But you should know that if you're going to try and take the soul off me, well, let's just say, I've been here a lot longer than you. I've used all that energy from the paper to complete my spirit, Lavender. I can wipe you out in one blow. Just step aside and let me through. I'm not moving. When is Grim coming? And I suppose I have no choice. I really don't want to fight you, Lavender. Oh shit. Good bad boss, Baker. Timmy, what are you doing? I've learned a thing or two from being a ghost, ghost sis. I can help you from the sidelines. What? No way. Just trust me. Just whatever you do, stay behind me. Gotcha. Uh, help, uh, skip. I don't know. Oh, 
our chair. We can do it. Can only perform. Baker can only perform uh, special moves if he swings right. Seems to favor poison and curse. Willpower 1358 out of 1500. That's a lot of willpower. Attack 75, defense 20, agility 120. Okay. Oh shit, my health is super low again. I missed when that happened. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Shit, I'm dead now, aren't I? Damn it. That does not take long for that fight to get turned around. Oh uh, shit. I, was, I thought I was doing good too. That's fine. Let's get our revenge. We'll get him good this time for sure. No, I. I won't let you. Lavender! Please stop! I just remembered something else I read about this game. It has multiple endings, so, um... We might not get a chance to retry. We might have just gotten a bad end. Uh-oh. Wake up. Please wake up. I... Grim? You're here. Quick, you gotta do something. The baker, he was just... He was just... He is gone. Yes, I received your message, but if it isn't too much to ask of you in your current states, would you mind explaining to me what has happened in your own words? You explained to him that you were traveling in the cave with him until both of you had stumbled upon a ghost with a soul. He stole the soul, trying to go back to his life, but you had chased him down for it. You fought, but he... He went back to life. But you can bring him back, right? You can just go through there and take him back. Or you could just talk to, I don't know, God or something, ask him nicely to bring him back. I've already mentioned this to you. I cannot do either of those things. I cannot pass the narrative from the true afterlife, nor can I contact anyone there. What can you do? Nothing. Nothing? Not a thing. No. No, that can't be right. Lavender, I'm sorry to interrupt you. But what happened, really? Why the sorrow? Were you hoping for a chance of life, too? No, I mean, yes, Lavender, you've been lying to me since you came here. 
You lied to me about the walk. You lied to me when you said you were okay. Please, confide in me. I don't have the energy to keep secrets anymore. The truth, the truth is, that soul belonged to my brother. Kenny, you can come out now. Are you sure? I'm sure. Hello, Mr. Graham. Please don't hurt me. That won't be necessary, Timmy. For now. What do you mean, for now? It stands to reason that since Timmy has only lost his soul recently, he is only an early ghost. That explains why he isn't hostile like other ghosts. Until your brother starts to show signs that he is transforming into a hostile ghost, we can keep him around whilst I look for a solution. Uh, Lola? Signs? Well, it begins small. Lola? Typically, there's a slight change in their appearance. Lavender? What is it? It only gradually gets worse. Put me in your pocket. Until finally, there's an absolute flip in their personality. Right, you just came out. Please, Lavender. I'm not feeling too good. Why are you both whispering? What is the matter? Nothing's wrong. Everything's fine. Oh, no. No, no, no. Timmy? Really? Timmy? Graham, what's happening? Seems that the time is much sooner than I thought. Lavender? I hate to say it. Uh... But if you want the best for your brother, you should reap him soon. Are you kidding me? No. Listen to me. If you let your brother fully transform, the both of you will suffer immensely. It is better to end it now than let the situation get worse. No, I can't let you do that. That's the one thing I've been trying to prevent. There is no other way. You, you don't know that. I've given you your options, Lavender. I do not want to take him by force. Really? That's a shame, because I'm not moving and I'm not saying goodbye. You are letting your emotions control you. If you do not say goodbye to him now, you will regret this. Come on, Timmy. Get behind me. So be it. Alright. Taking down Grim. We got one HP. What if I were to do nothing? What then? Can I heal? You and your brother would be alone. You would turn hostile and you would be forced to reap him. You expect me to hand over my brother to die? This is the problem with all you reapers. I seem to forget that you are all already dead. Passed out. No, I, I won't give up. I can't let myself faint. No. Uh, Lala? Where are you? Help! You are still awake. Lavender? Lavender! Lavender, stop! You cannot pass on yet. Your spirit isn't strong enough. 
I want to go home. The last little tummy. We hired a new substitute baker. Mothers inquired about what happened to the previous baker. I said he passed on. It is rare for me to be put in such a situation where I feel shame, a sense of wrongdoing. But it is there whenever I think about the chaotic situation that happened that day. I am frightened that if I tell the truth, then others will try something similar, knowing that one managed to do so. The only trust I feel is for one reaper, and she has disappeared from the hollow. Instead, she has seemed to make the kids her new homes. Try as I might to bring her here. All she does is reap, 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 one after the other, tirelessly. Every now and then another reaper sees her and becomes startled. They get frightened. I gave her an option to wear a mask. She declined. Declined by ignoring my presence. She does not speak anymore. But sometimes, even her relentless drive fails her and she passes out. Passes out. No one has bothered to help her out or wake her up. They find her scary. So I teleport her out to the hollow and tuck her in. I leave her cookies and milk. I know it doesn't compensate for what I've done. I do not expect her to forgive me. But when I come back, she's gone again, so are the cookies. Sometimes, sometimes she just sits in front of the gate of passing as if waiting or remembering. If only I could... No, it's too late. Not even I can bring back the dead. The only thing I can do is live with my mistakes. So cool though. Um, I have not been saving my game whatsoever outside of the very first dungeon we entered because I am a super genius. So if you want to see the better ending, there's three endings. I assume this is the worst of the three endings, uh, but I'm not sure. It might be the middle ending. Definitely not the good ending. But if you want to see the other endings, you're just going to have to play it for yourself. And, and look at look at her, the, the creepy reaper who lives in the caves and is eternally tormented. What a fun time. This was a cool game. Even like the, the bad ending was pretty neat. So I'm, I'm happy I got to see that. Definitely got to go back at some point and get the good ending. But I think for streaming purposes, I think that's probably a good place to wrap it up. And it gives you incentive to try it for yourself. So that's kind of cool. And We try? No. The progress will not be saved. Um, I'm going to leave you on a cliffhanger anyway. I think you should play it. I think the game's cool. I think it's worth it. And we're going to bounce back to the screen and wrap things up for the night. Uh, thank you, everyone, who made it out to the stream today. And thank you to VOD watchers as well. And uh, just yeah, anybody who swings by, um, I hope you had fun. You know, if, if I'm going to be stuck in this weird nightmare fueled purgatory, might as well play some games and, and try to have some good times with it. Uh, definitely a lot of games about uh, being dead. Not not sure what that says about um, the selection that they're giving me to play here. But it is a little fitting, so I guess that's probably why. But yeah, thank you all for coming out. And let's uh, pop up the schedule one last time, too.
So yeah, uh, we did a Rose and Twilight Tuesday. We just finished Grimm's Hollow today. And tomorrow, stream is going to be a little bit earlier. It's going to be at 12 a.m. UTC instead of 3 a.m. UTC. So that would be time zones. Time zones are something special, aren't they? I love time zones. They're, they confuse me. I can figure that out. I think, wait, 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 wait. I can do this. Hold on. Three am UTC was eight p.m. PST. So twelve a.m. UTC would be five p.m. PST or three p.m. EST. Wait, seven p.m. Today's was seven. Wait. 12 is 7 p.m.? Okay. Well, numbers are hard. What can I say? Uh, anyway, 12 a.m. UTC. Yamalari, Night Alone. I'm excited to try that one, too. That's another NIS game. Um, pretty different from Rose in the Twilight, but also very dark. Um, I haven't played much of it. I've just played the beginning, and the beginning is pretty fucked up. So we'll see how that goes. And then Spooky Jump Scare Mansion is going to be kind of the lighthearted one, question mark, on Saturday. So that's cool, too. And that wraps it up. So let's find somebody to raid before we end this. And we see what's going down at this hour. Not a whole lot of people active right now. I'm kind of surprised by that one. Um, <laughs> if anyone else has a suggestion for a raid target, please let me know. So my follow list is surprisingly not, not very active at 11 o'clock on whatever day it is. 11 o'clock my time. Um... Nice relaxing, you may not have to I'll give you a second to check that out. Nice relaxing waterfall sounds to wrap up the evening. That's always nice. Um, oh yeah, I'm going to mention it on stream tomorrow, but from the little bit I played of uh, Emory, uh just a bit, bit of a trigger warning starting out the gate. I mean, a lot of these games are dark, but that one I know very, very early on has really really depressing bad stuff with a dog and i know for me that stopped me from playing it for a really long time because you know animal stuff is, is rough so um yeah you know just a, a word of warning for anyone who tunes in that day all right um cool yeah let's uh you know what i've never actually seen a uh, puppy stream. And that seems like an incredibly fitting raid target for tonight, considering, you know, everyone wearing skull masks today. So might as well keep the theme going, you know? So uh, I'll set up for that then. Why is that? Yes, yeah, so that's a it's just P A P I. That's nice and simple. I like it. I tried to get mine that simple, but uh, four characters is pretty easy. Puck is very loud. All right, well, everybody, be ready for loud. Let's let's do it. All right, and Poppy. Oh, and what was our raid message going to be again? Let me scroll back up and see if I can see it. We had a good one. Pocket was it like pocket tanning or something like that? Um, pocket in your head. That's right, pocket in your head. Let me do that. All right. I'll see you all on the other side then. Uh, in nine seconds, eight seconds, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one.
Which is bothers. Which is bothers. 